Hello, everybody, and welcome to Bedrock with Fix. That's right, we're back in the world. Man, I'm really, really loving this. So I am back down here in the mine, just starting to mine. Now, I, I have the coordinates showing because what I realized is my mine was down at Y13, and I really prefer to mine at, my, at Y11. Reason being is that uh, so um, if you fall into lava, uh, which is absolutely possible, particularly on your phone, <laughs> because you can't you can't see the ground that well whenever you're mining. Uh, what's nice of it is uh, this is gonna break any section. I mean another another shovel, darn it. Um, what's nice is that that if you're down here at Y what Y11, then you can always just jump back uh, up to the surface because you're not you're not too high up. So it's a really nice little uh, little tip that I like to do. I always mine at Y11 for everything basically i mean every time i'm doing mining i just do that because that way you're gonna get diamonds and if you're in extreme hills you could get emeralds as well and we are in an extreme hills here i think so uh, actually we might be in roof forest <laughs> actually right now i'm not exactly sure it, they, they sort of inter intersect but i'm not too worried about emeralds as of now i'm really worried primarily about about diamonds uh, it's nice to get some gold as well but and iron too actually so i'm worried about everything except for i'm not worried about redstone <laughs> I'm not worried about redstone. I'm worried about everything else except for uh, redstone. Uh, but it's even cobblestone, honestly, we need we even need that. Uh, what I'd like to do here is I would like to get working fairly shortly here on an enchanting table because I have 29 levels. By the end of this mining trip, I'll probably be up around 30 and be able to enchant a pickaxe. However, problem is we don't have uh, we don't have any books and not even not even close to making the. Uh, what do you need? 15 bookcases? So 15 bookcases, that's 45 books. And uh, yeah, we're, we're so far from that. So what I'm thinking is, I'm thinking I mine for a little while, I get like one inventory worth of mining. Uh, and, and then I cut, and then I think maybe we go exploring and looking for a village together. How would that be? Fun? I, I'd really like to see the new villages. I think that'd be a really fun thing to do. And uh, yeah, why not, right? Um, so let me mine, let me get some mining done and I'll come back and then we'll do, we'll do a little, a little bit of exploring together just, uh, just for fun. A couple really positive things have just happened. For one thing, if I'm standing right about here, it's very faint, but I can hear skeletons walking around. Hmm. So that's a good thing. Uh, but, uh, in addition, because maybe it's a skeleton spawner, that's why it's a good thing. Uh, but I found emeralds, so that's cool. I probably shouldn't have mined that, darn it. I should not have mined that. I should have waited until I get, uh, fortune. We're a long way from getting fortune on diamonds, unfortunately, I don't think, unless we find one in the village. Hmm. Which we might. Hmm. Maybe I should just mark these and just wait. I should have waited for the emerald too. Darn it. Darn me. Uh, but... Because even, even if the villagers have a good trade, I'm not going to be in any condition to trade with them yet. Uh, let's just wait. Let's just mark that there's diamonds right here. Something like that that tells me, hey, look up. <laughs> look up, there's diamonds right there. I'm going to keep going. I'm going to keep looking. I might just mark the diamonds because, um, oh, also, check this out. Look at that guy. Look at this jerk. Yeah. Uh, we're definitely in extreme hills. That's why we found emeralds and also uh, random silverfish. So that's not as much fun but it is what it is it's part of the game and uh that's fine I, silverfish are just annoying it's, they're just annoying I, whatever it, it adds something to the add some some interest i guess to mining but come on give us a mining update that would be great a mine underground update oh baby caving update that would be cool anyway let me continue on building and i'll see you back at the top side okay let's go exploring shall we i have nine pieces of steak which is good and, uh, you know, uh, that's it. That's all I got. I don't even have a sword, uh, but I have a bed. So I shouldn't need a sword since I have a bed. That's my goal. That's what I'm hoping. And, uh, yeah, and I wrote down the coordinates. The coordinates are found right here in chat of my new village. Needs to be named. Needs to be named. So, uh, instead of a poll question today, I am looking for a name of our little uh, village, our little, our little town area here. So, uh, if you have a suggestion... Uh, then all you got to do is put it down in the comments. Put it down in the comments. You name the village. I'll pick the name that strikes my fancy the most, and that's the name that we'll go with, okay? So, uh, yeah, come up with it. anything you want. Remember, this world is not the realm of Bastion. This is a completely different world. Hello. Uh, okay, yeah, I should have brought a sword. Okay, I should. In retrospect, in retrospect, lesson learned, I should have brought a sword. Okay, it's all right. Maybe a skeleton will drop a... a a bone or a, a bow rather <laughs> uh, uh so anyway, yeah we're just exploring now i happen to know there's a village if you go south from our unnamed village uh, i happen to know that there is one there so i'm gonna kind of go instead i'm going east i wait which way am i going 
I'm going up. Oh, you know what? I'm going... Yeah, no, I'm going... This is very confusing. I'm going west, right? I think I'm going west. I think there's a decent chance I'm going west, but I don't know. Either way, I have the coordinates of home, so I can get there. So, uh, yeah, I'm just looking for a village here. So, uh, hmm. Let's see. There's some llamas. That's cool. Kind of an unnecessary addition to the game, honestly. But, you know, I'm not going to complain about extra stuff. I was... I, I generally won't complain about stuff that they give. I'll only complain that they uh, that I want more. I want more, more. I want more in this ten year old game that we don't pay for outside the initial time. Darn it! <laughs> it's ridiculous. It's ridiculous, but still, yeah, I do want more. So uh, let's keep uh, looking for a village. I found a village. Oh my goodness! No, I didn't not find a village. I found a village outpost. That's my first one I've ever seen. Now, I don't have any weapons. So, I'm thinking that wandering up to this thing is likely a bad move. Is this a bad move? It probably is a bad move. I don't see any uh, pillagers. Maybe they're gone. Maybe they're at work. Ooh, a desert, too. Wow, this has been a good trip. So, I found sand, a desert, and a uh, and, and sheep just spawned. Look at this. I see no... Oh, I see one pillager. Oh, boy. Did they see me? If they're coming, I will run away so fast. You know what? Let's look for a desert. Let's look for a desert village since uh, that it, that way is barred. But that's really cool. That's really cool. We may be able to do something with that at some point. We need to remember where that is. So the coordinates are, hey, could someone do me a favor? Could someone write this down in a comment in this video? Uh, 570, 4, 1443. 570, 1443. It, it, I, I would take it as a favor if you would just write that in a comment of the, where the villager outpost is. Okay, we'll work together on this on this series. Now, again, uh, one of the things, you know, um, right when I started this series, and I started this as like a very, a very uh, sort of sort of cooperative single player world. Uh, I saw that uh, Paul uh, Solis, is it Solis? I think it's Solis Jr. Uh, one of the one of the OG Minecrafters, one of the original Minecrafters ever, started a series that's basically the same thing. He puts a poll up and everyone picks his direction. Just remember, I did it first. <laughs> not first. I'm sure there are a lot of people who have done this before, but uh, I'm not I'm not copying you, Paul. <laughs> like, hey, Paul, if you're watching this video, <laughs> I'm not copying you. Uh, yeah, yeah. Anyway, he's a wonderful Minecrafter. He's the one he's uh, he's the one singular person that's responsible for me starting this game because I watched his series, I forget what it's called, but it was Ars Magica. He had a name for it. It was like uh uh what it was like a, it was a role play. It was a magic role play, like a silly role play thing where he kind of, kind of role played loosely, loosely role. Like if I was ever going to do role play, which I, I don't really see happening, but if I was ever going to do it, it's how I would do it. Like not take, he didn't take it very seriously and kind of role played a character kind of bit and stuff like that. It, it's, it's fun to watch though. Um, if you, if you're curious about it, join my discord and I will link it for you there. That'll be the best place to, to check. It. It's fun. It's fun to, uh, watch some of his older series. Um, Okay, well, all that being said, I can't find a village, so I'm just going to keep on searching. I'm just searching randomly, you know, because I, I know where, I know how to get home, so not a big deal. But this is finding a mine in Mesa just here. That's really, really convenient. Okay, I'll see you at home. Still searching. Still searching here, but I just realized a couple things. For one thing, the desert is east, not west. It's east. Uh, and on the other side of the desert, there is a an ocean, which is wonderful. Also... Hey, I'll take a couple rose bushes for sure because that is unlimited uh, dyes for a couple colors. So yes, thank you. These double hall bu double high bushes are really nice for that. Um, who knows? Uh, it, it's really it'd be really. Oh, you know what? These are those, those these are the new ones. Cornflower, and they make blue dye. How cool is that? That's really cool. Okay, so here there's like a flower forest biome. That would be really good to make a flower farm in. Because I'm pretty sure if you bone meal this, you actually get all the flowers. So here's another. Okay, here's another uh, uh, comment. Comment for someone. Okay, uh, flower forest 610, 2026. Okay, 610, 2026. Because that way, if I ever want to do an ink and a dye farm, now that we have like access to blue and to uh, all the colors except for black, I think uh, that is really. Oh, that that. Oh, look at that. That that'd be a cool place for a build. This is a really nice location for, for a future little area. Very nice. Very nice. Oh, I like this world, too. Having a fun time. Uh, I'm going to continue on searching. 
continue on searching. I'm watching my wife uh, not be able to get convinced my one-year-old to go to sleep right now. It's Saturday, so we're all at home, and he, she's laying there. Uh, we have a video monitor, you know. She's laying there with him, and he is just doing like somersaults on the bed over her. <laughs> just the look on her face is total defeat. <laughs> total defeat right now. Uh, maybe I'll go relieve her soon. Uh, I see the kids are a little bit a little bit more used to me putting them down for a nap. I think maybe maybe, maybe I could have a little bit more success. Well, uh, either way, she's she's got a little bit more time to put in before I go off. Okay, I'll see you in a second. I'm a big cheater. I'm a big cheater. Here's the thing: if this were Java, I'll take that. <laughs> I mean, why not, right? I, I I have one already, but I'll take it. If this were Java, I would have just used Amidst or one of those, but I uh, don't believe that those work in Bedrock. Um, so I did locate command. <laughs> I thought it might be here. Yeah, look at this new village. First time I've seen one. Awesome. Uh, I did the locate command. And again, I did it because... Oh, yes. Hey, sunflowers. That's really cool. I'll definitely take those. Again, unlimited yellow dye. Cool. Um, yeah, uh, I did it because it, uh, if I were playing Java, I would have access to one of the many mapping programs and spending two hours a day uh, today just walking around the landscape uh, looking for a village it does not, uh, I, you know, it doesn't seem like that great of a use of time. Wow, look at that. A bed. I mean, I, I, I know. I've seen the snapshots. I know, like, this is so weird. It, oh, it's a tree, uh, part of the house. That, that's cool. Uh, but here is some good stuff. Oh, man, I'm so happy. Potatoes, I'm so happy for you. I'm so happy. Uh, I'm so happy. Uh, I'm going to plant just a few. I, I'm not going to replant the whole thing. Oh, I'm in a boat. You know why? You know why I'm in a boat? You know why I'm in a boat? I'm in a boat because I did the exact same thing. I keep pushing. I keep doing it because I can't learn. But uh, let's just plant like three. <laughs> I'll keep all the rest. It's fine. It's fine. They don't need to eat that much. Oh, look at that iron golems up there. Uh, this lovely terrain gen. Uh, let's see what's in here. Look at that. The bell. Oh, that, mean, that makes them run for the hills. Well, that's okay. <laughs> uh, that's okay. It's a good practice. Oh, what is this? Beetroot? Uh, uh, Beetroot's so crappy. Uh, what's in here? Some, some animals? That's really cool. That's super cool. Oh, man. I love these new villages. It's such a nice addition. Look at that. This guy. I mean, I have all this stuff really, but how cool. How freaking cool. I love these flower boxes. I didn't actually I didn't know that they included those. That's really cool too. And what else do we got? There's a church over there I see. This is a pretty beefy village as far as it goes. Oh hey buddy. What, what do you what do you sell? You are a stonemason. Interesting. Okay. Wait. Why do you walk away? I thought I thought they changed that so they didn't walk away. Uh did I just reset my spawn point? I did not mean to do that. Okay. That's unfortunate if I die. What's this guy do? Oh, not this netwood. Okay. Got it. Got it. Anything in here? Cool. You know what? I actually will, uh, I'll, I will take your stuff. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm sorry for taking your stuff, but yeah, I might need it. Oh, I like that. There's a little colored glass in the church. That's really cool too. I did not know that. Oh, a brewing stand. Hmm. Yeah, I'll take that brewing stand. Sorry. I, I guess I guess the, the village and pillage update is really for me pillaging this, but I yeah, I need that brewing stand. I need a you know, come on. Come on. Anything up here? No. This is this is quite a find. It's quite a find. I didn't get carrots, but you know what? I can live without carrots because I got potatoes, and that is wonderful. That is wonderful. That's a big, 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 big help. What's over here? Uh oh, this village is. This terrain gen is screwed up. <laughs> it's, it's on the side of this cliff. That's not that helpful. Anything in here? Oh, yeah. Oh, lots of stuff. Cool. More potatoes. More apples. Some emeralds. Nice. Nice. Yeah, this is a fantastic find. Uh, yeah, so I, I'm sorry. I'm sorry if that made everyone mad that, that I used the locate command. But I would have had a map if this were the version that I'm used to. I would have had a map and, you know, I don't here. So whatever. It is fine. It's fine. It is what it is. I, I probably would have eventually found this just after hours and hours and hours of searching. And I, I just I don't have that kind of time. So we had to knock it out. Uh, it's almost time to sleep, which is good, actually, in a way, because I can I can set my spawn back to nothing once I break my bed. And that's probably a good thing. <laughs> that's probably a good thing that way. Um, uh, no worries for uh, coming the whole way back here because we're pretty far away. We're actually pretty far away. Uh, I wouldn't mind that bell, but I think that might be a little bit stealing. Uh, I'm just really making sure there's no carrots. Wheat and beetroot, beetroot, beetroot. I got a couple that I can play. Actually, you know what? I'll, I'll take all this wheat, honestly. 
Let's sleep. I'll take all the wheat too because that will help me breed up my breed up my cows. It's a nice, nice starter, and you know these guys don't need it, right? I, I don't think they need it. Oh, the composter. I forgot about that. that that's actually that's not so bad. I can make one of those. I think. Should I just should I take it? I think I'll take it. I mean, why, why not? It's right here. It's asking to be taken. It's asking to be taken. Okay. Uh, we got some cats. I think that's going to be it, though. Unfortunately, it looks like we do not have carrots. And that's all right. That's all right. I can live on big food. Big food is our better food. It's just that you have to cook them. That's just the only drag, you know? But that's all right. That's all right. Look, look I can't even run because I'm, I'm out of health. Oh, boy. Didn't mean to do that. Okay. Time to eat. <laughs> Easy enough. Okay, well, I guess I will uh, just go, and I'll see you back at uh, I'll see you back at home, and we'll uh, figure out maybe uh, where we're gonna figure out a farm, or who knows what's next. We'll see you once we get home. So remember how when I started the episode, there was a whole bunch of different things I was gonna do, and I talked about, it, and I was like, oh, let's do this, and let's do this, let's do storage building, blah 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 blah. Well, everything has changed now that we have potatoes, because I need to eat. Eating is a number one priority. I mean, we are playing in hard mode, so if I starve, not that I think I'm going to starve, but if I starve, like, I'm going to actually starve. You know what I mean? So, uh, what I want to do here is I want to find a place for our sort of big farm. Um, and there's a few options that I have, but I don't think it's going to be right here. Like, this is a cool area, but I think I want this to be all, like houses and stuff in this area. So, I'm thinking there's, there's another area just... Um, which way is it? I think it's just over this way, like through the forest. Let's go check. I, I'm almost sure there's a clearing just on the other side of this forest. Is that? Oh yeah, that's yeah. R.I.P. R.I.P. My first wandering trader ever. Uh, the zombies uh, in this uh, in this root forest. They are they are a real problem. <laughs> I mean, they're going to be at some point. They'll be gone. But but uh, yeah. I mean, you know, the roof forest will be cut back so far. Uh, ignore the uh, the baby complaining about being in bed right now. That he is he is just fine. He's just fine. He's just irritated that he is in bed. But that's okay. It's nap time, and that is uh, that is how we do things. So, uh, oh, look over there. A little, little uh, those are probably that's probably not a skeleton spawner. I just don't know why they're right there. Um, let's sleep. Let's sleep, and then figure out where we can put this farm. I don't want the farm to be too far away. I mean, this is my base for a while. It's going to be that way for a good bit of time. So I don't want to have to walk a long way. And the other thing is I want it to be rendered. So we may actually be, I mean, I want crops to grow. So that means I have to be a certain distance. So we may actually already be too far away. Yeah, I may have to, see what I mean? See what I mean? This jerk, this jerk, uh, jerky jerk. This roof forest, there's just zombies and skeletons and crap all over the place because uh, there's no light, you know? Uh, boy, I, speaking of roof forest, in the realm of Vast in season four, um, I'm hoping that we're gonna create a roof forest, like a real one, and not like this tiny little only like six block high roof forest, but like a like a forty block high roof forest. Oh baby, that would be so cool. Yeah, so I don't know. You know what? Oh yeah, there's a hitbox. You can't just walk through those. That's right. Uh, I don't know. Maybe this place is the is the place for But so what concerns me is though. I've been here a, a, you know, a small amount of time, and the sugar cane has not grown at all. So apparently, you need to be closer. So I guess that's even more of a reason why it just needs to be like just right here. So I guess what we'll do is we'll just make this uh, the potato farm, like right, like right here, or just kind of fill up this area with potatoes. I guess I don't know. It, it's it's probably not ideal, and maybe I'll rip it out later, but. But uh, that's going to be our food source. That's going to be our food source for, for a good long while. And uh, yeah. So let me get let me get to planting. I only have like 40 some potatoes. But I do have a bucket man, and uh, kind of a plan on how I want to do it. I want to do it in a set of sort of 9 by 9s I think. And make it make a really nice patch. But to do that I'm going to need a hoe. So uh, let me get to let me get to planting here. And, uh, and we'll come back and, and discuss the farming aspect. The potatoes are planted and they are beginning the process of uh, uh of, of growing hopefully hopefully everything is, is fine with that i think what i'm gonna do i think i'm gonna wrap up this episode now and reason being a i want to know what you folks you awesome amazing viewers my youtube buddies my youtube friends uh want to name this this kingdom that we're in i guess we'll just call it a kingdom just you know like we like i do everything else uh so yeah what do you want to what do you want to name this what, what's your what are your thoughts and uh 
you know, I, I have a couple thoughts. I have a couple thoughts, but I, I'd, I'd really, really rather take it take it from uh, from you folks. You, you, you elect to spend part of your day here. So I'd rather, I'm going to choose a name of this kingdom from the comments. Whenever uh, next episode hits, we'll have a name for the kingdom and we're going to build uh, our storage system. Uh, but in the meantime, I'm going to go mining. I'm going to go mining because we are, uh, well, I'm lacking some resources, honestly. And I'm also, I'm just hoping that if, while I'm mining that these crops will grow. Um, you know, I, we didn't get a carrot. I can live on baked potatoes. You know, I mean, it's, it costs some coal. Oh, okay. Look, another one. But yeah, it's, it's going to spawn all the time. Uh, uh, you know, I, I, I'm hoping to get a carrot. I did get some messages uh, that, that suggested finding in treasure chests. Uh, what's your sugar? No, uh... Nothing good. Puzzle is uh, not renewable, I don't think, in Bedrock, unless 114 changes. I made some um, I made some 2x2 two two spruce trees, and I did not get the puzzle. Maybe only in some biomes or something, but everything else there I don't think we really need. So, all right, what I'm going to do, I'm going to go mining, okay? I'm going to go mining, and uh, whenever I come back, next episode, you folks uh, name it, name it, and we will, uh, we'll, we'll go from, we'll go from, you, wait, you know what? Hold on a second. Hold on. I was gonna cut off. I was gonna cut there, but I want to do one. I want to do one thing. I want to do one thing before before we wrap this up. Hold on. Let me find quickly. Let me find quickly my uh my my iron. I'm gonna make a pair of shears. I know I have shears, but hold on. I, I've been meaning to do this. It's a real simple little thing, and we need it. I I actually I have shears in my inventory. I'm such a tool. I have shears right literally in my inventory. Idiot. Fix. I'm, I'm an idiot. Fix is an idiot. Okay, uh, here's what I want to do. I want to grab these, all of these things, all of these things. Uh, okay, and what I want to do here is right here. I want to go. Boop, 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 and a little bit over here. Um, and right there. Okay. Uh, and also here, here, and here. And we'll we'll make the rest of this look better. Later. <laughs> uh, but at least it's something for the screenshot that looks a little bit more green. Okay. <laughs> I can't believe I spent time doing that. Okay. All right. I'll see you on next episode. Name my, name my kingdom, name my kingdom. And uh, we'll do the storage thing next time. Okay. Bye everyone. Hey folks, I just want to say a special thank you to my patrons, my YouTube members, uh, the help that you give me to maintain this stuff and just keep the ball rolling on, on these, uh, especially daily videos. Yikes. That's a grind. Uh, it, it's just, it's extraordinary. I couldn't do it without you. So thank you so much, uh, for all of your support, your generosity and, and, and the, the tips and all that super chats and all that stuff. It means, it means the world to me and my family. It really makes a huge difference for us. So, uh, you folks over there, thank you so much. And, uh, we'll see you next time.